my name is Kari and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be reviewing and styling the best winter fashion trends. The fall and winter season are my favorite seasons when it comes to fashion because I'm not going to lie, your boy do hate the cold. But that don't got nothing to do with this video. The fall and winter is my favorite season for fashion for the simple fact you can layer your pieces and it gives you more options to put more pieces together and really bring out your creativity. So that's why I like fashion in the winter. Now let's actually talk about these trends. In my opinion, I feel like it's five major fashion trends this winter. Number one is an OG one. Everybody and their auntie got a black puffer jacket. A black puffer jacket is a staple into your winter collection. And if you don't got a black puffer jacket, I don't know what you're doing with your life. Like you need to get up on that. And I don't have too much to say about a black puffer jacket. It's a classic. It's a staple on everyone's winter wardrobe. And yeah, the next trend we're gonna talk about are face masks. We're not gonna talk about black ski masks because in my opinion, those are really simple and are getting really played out. And some of y'all niggas don't even look fashionable. Y'all be looking like thieves. So instead, we're gonna be talking about knitted masks. I feel like knitted face masks are one of the best accessories right now because they're so versatile. You can dress them up, you can dress it down. You can even roll them up and wear them as a beanie. For the third trend, we have jackets. And this can be any type of jacket. This can be a workwear jacket, a leather jacket, a varsity jacket, just jackets in general. And like I said at the beginning of the video, one of the reasons I love the winter so much is because it's a great time to layer. And a jacket is a perfect layering piece. For one, it's so many variations of different jackets out there. So you can put together different outfits with those different types of jackets. And jackets are in that mix where it's not too thick, but it's not too thin. So you can still have fun and layer pieces together and really show your creativity. For the fourth trend, we have boots. But I'm not talking about any regular boots. I'm talking about the large space looking boots. I would say the past year and a half to two years or so, Rick Owen boots, Yeezy boots, and Bottega boots have gotten real popular lately, and I love it. I just think these boots are so different from your normal boots and bring in a whole different element and just make your outfit stand out a hundred times more and they're getting weirder and bulkier and I just really love this trend that's going on now. And as for the last trend, we have coats. Personally, I feel like coats have been at every winter runway I've been watching. Like before I made this video, I did some research, watched a couple of runways and almost every single runway have coats. Just like with puffer jackets, I also feel the same way with coats. I feel like everyone should have a good coat in their winter rotation. All right, those are all the trends I'm gonna talk about. Now, let me actually put some outfits together and show you guys what I will wear with these and how I'll style them. All right, right now I'm in my closet deciding which piece I wanna use first to put an outfit together with. And I'm not gonna lie, I think I'm gonna start off with using a black puffer. I think this is gonna be the first piece we use and put an outfit together with. Also, I have never shown y'all my closet before. And let me know if y'all want a closet tour because my closet low-key nice. Like, like my closet working with something now. My closet working with something. I don't, I don't want to show y'all too much. I don't want to show y'all too much. Comment below if y'all want a closet. Like I said in the last clip, I will be using this black puffer. And I think I'm going to put it together with these handmade rust denim. Real quick, I just want to say these denim are beautiful. Yeah, I have the base of the outfit figured out. Now I need to figure out the shoes and probably some accessories. All right, I know my mirror is broken. And I know you can't even see my fit right now, but I do have on the jacket and the pants. Also, I think I'm going to be wearing the Swervent Exterminator boots, but I'm not going to lie. These some big motherfuckers right here and I got some skinny jeans on, so I don't know how these are going to look. And I'm using two pieces and one outfit. So that's a plus. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with these boots. These are crazy. These are so crazy. Okay, I have decided to also add in the mask for this outfit. I kind of don't want to use the mask because I did use three pieces and one outfit. But in my opinion, the mask take this outfit from a regular just hard outfit to an OD crazy. All right, I finished the second outfit. Now let's make the second one. 
Okay, for the next outfit, I have decided I'm gonna wear a jacket. These are the three pieces I am thinking about styling. This Carhartt jacket, this varsity one, and this blazer. So I'm gonna put a couple of outfits together and see which one I like more. I've decided to use this blazer and this is the look I've came up with so far. But it So we use the red blazer with the sweater vest underneath it with the collar shirt underneath that and with these blue jeans. Okay, so this is what the outfit looks like when it's actually on me and I really do like this look. The only thing I need to do now is figure out which shoes to wear with it. Okay, I'm currently trying to figure out which shoes to wear. And honestly, this is just a sign that I need to buy new shoes because I don't know what to wear with this outfit. I might just have to go with the old reliable to Rick Owens, but I do want to switch it up. I'm not going to lie. I do want to switch it up. I think I might end up going with these, the bread ones, just because they add a little streetwear element to it and spice up the outfit. I'm not going to lie. I really think the Chicago's will go crazy with this outfit, but I don't have these. Lassie, if you're watching this video, Nigga, trade me your Chicago's. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the ones. The ones make this outfit look even better. I ain't gonna lie. I low-key fell in love with this outfit. So when you see this on the ground and you watch the video, you saw my mindset putting that outfit together. So you a real one for that. All right, let's put together the last and final fit. All right, this is the coat I will be using. And I'm gonna be honest, all the other outfits, I had a direction of what I wanted to wear. But this one, I really don't have any direction. Okay, I'm thinking maybe this sweater will go nice with it. I'm also thinking about using these Wrath trousers to give it that high-end look. Okay, so this is how the outfit looks so far. And it's decent. I think I can do better. So I'm going to go back into my closet and see what more I can do with it. But this is how it looks. And I just think it's a simple fit. And I can for sure add more to it. All right, we back in the closet, plotting on some different ideas. Okay, I think we're going to use this sweater and layer it. Okay, so this is the third and final fit. And this is what I end up going with. I'm not going to lie. With this outfit, I feel like I need to be marching with the Black Panthers. But that's besides the point. That's besides the point. I decided to add this hat just for accessories. And I'm probably going to wear my Doc Martin loafers to really pull this outfit together. And this is the third fit. Okay, I finished putting all the outfits together. And here's the outfit reveals. If you made it to this point in the video, I just would like to say thank you for watching the full video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and let me know which outfit you thought was the best. Also, follow me on all my socials. They will be linked in the description, and I'm out. Peace.